Hello YouTube land, today I'm coming with another video that was um, a pickup of some baseball cards that I got from the Leap Day, uh, February 29th baseball card show in Nashville, Tennessee. This time I'm looking at a set that I know nothing about, but it was only $5, so I thought this is bound to be worth something to me. There's bound to be something in here it, that I would want. It is a 2004 USA Baseball 25th Anniversary hand collated set. So generally speaking, I do not purchase uh, USA Baseball um, products. Um, they really have no interest to me, but I suspect there's probably someone in here that I've heard of that would be interesting, and it's only $5. So uh, I do not know what to expect out of here. And again, I'm hoping that as a hand collated set, I know nothing about the dealer, uh, let's hope that everything is really in here. Uh, I was collecting in uh, 2004, but uh, like I said, I, I tend to not pick up these products. So let's uh, just start going through here and see who makes up the set. And so I'm hoping that more than half the people in here eventually went on to become major leaguers that I can at least uh, uh, add them some of these uh, to uh, my collection. So we're going to start with Jim Abbott. Brent Abernathy. I did see Jim Abbott pitch once um, back in the early 90s. Kurt Ainsworth. Uh, Matt Anderson. Cards are a little bit thicker than I thought they would be. And uh, seems like the I thought these were going to be in alphabetical order until I got to Justin Wayne, and that is card number seven. Scott Bankhead. Josh Bard. Michael Barrett. Buddy Bell, I'm guessing that he was a coach as a Ranger fan. He was the uh, popular third baseman of the 80s, so I'm glad to see that one. Andy Bennis, Chris Benson, Peter Bergeron, Willie Bloomquist, Jeremy Bonderman, Jeff Weaver. So, so far I'd say about more than half of these players uh, went on to become uh, major leaguers that I have heard of. Ricky Weeks. Again, strange how some of the W's there seem to be uh, out of order. Milton Bradley, he was a uh, one-time Ranger. Ben Broussard. Kirk Bollinger. Jeremy Burnitz. Pat Burrell. Sean Burrows. Paul Bird. Chris Capuano. Will Clark. Now there's someone in my uh, personal collection there that uh, glad to have that. I did not know that uh, there was a card of him in this set. So that's uh, that's a nice pickup right there. Chad Cordero, Carl Crawford, Bobby Crosby, Brad Wilkerson, Michael Kadire, Ben Davis, and Travis Gookie Dawkins. R.A. Dickey. Of course, another uh, former Ranger. Didn't get good until he was no longer with the Rangers, but also a uh, Nashvillian. Um, my wife has met him in person. Glad to have a uh, card of him. Lenny DiNardo, Ryan Dries, uh, he was a Ranger. Justin Dukeshare was a Ranger. Scott Ellerton. Adam Everett. Dan Wilson, the catcher for the Mariners. Steve Finley, Casey Fossum, Terry Francona, was he a player or a manager? <laughs> Ryan Franklin, Ryan Friel was a red for a while. My wife liked him. Nomar Garcia Parra, that was probably a hot card back in 2004, I suppose. Jody Garrett, Jason Giambi. I would not have recognized him on... Uh, on that card. Wow. Matt Ginter, Troy Glaus, Tom Goodwin, another Ranger draft pick. Uh, Danny Graves was a red for a while. Sean Green, a Dodger. Khalil Green, Todd Green, the catcher. Uh, Gabe Gross, Jeffrey Hammonds, Aaron Heilman, Paul Wilson.
Looks like we're about halfway through the set here. Got a uh, Todd Helton, Dustin Hermanson, Bobby Hill, Coy Hill, <laughs> AJ Hinch. Uh, not having a uh, good time here recently, but back when he was a uh, catcher. Orlando Hudson, Ernie Young, Jason Jennings, Charles Johnson, Jock Jones, Matt Cada, Austin Kearns, another player that my wife liked, Brooks Kieschnick, Cubs, Scott Casimir, remember who was Ray, Billy Koch, Paul Canerco, he was a, uh, a hot rookie there for a while, the Reds and the White Sox. Casey Kochman, Chris Snyder, Nick Swisher, Gerald Laird, Tiger, and a, uh, yeah, okay, Barry Larkin. So that's um, all-star, uh, I mean, uh, and a, a Hall of Famer. So um, my wife is uh, certainly going to like that card. Mike Lamb was a Ranger. Tommy Lasorda. So I guess he was a uh, coach after no longer being with the uh, Dodgers. So that's good. Travis Lee, John Vanderwall, Braden Looper, Shane Liu, Ryan Ludwig. He was an A and Ranger. Jason Veritek, Ryan Madsen, Dave Maganin. That's kind of an interesting uh, picture. Did he win a? Uh, was he a Golden Spike Award winner? I can't say that I've ever seen that trophy. Unlike the Heisman, I'm not uh, sure what the Golden Spikes trophy looks like. So another um, player that my wife collects, uh, Tino Martinez, Joe Maurer, Robin Ventura, Blackjack McDowell, Todd Walker, and I wonder if this was the card to have out of the set because it has a penny sleeve on it. So there we've got Mark McGuire. And this card has blue at the top and red at the bottom, which has made it different than every other card I've seen. So uh, I'm not quite sure uh, why that one is a little bit different. They must have highlighted it uh, somehow. Uh, on the back, arguably the most famous USA baseball alum. His uniform number from 1984 was retired in 99. So the USC star led the 84 national team with 13 doubles and connected for six homers that summer. So um, uh, all-time great there. And it reminds me of his uh, top rookie card. So we're back to uh, Gil Mesh. Bonus points if you remember how to pronounce Doug Mankiewicz. Matt Morris, Warren Morris, Mark Mulder, A's pitcher, Calvin Murray, Eric Munson, Mike Messina, went on to have a uh, good career with the Orioles, um, Xavier Nady, John Olerud, rare photo of him without wearing a helmet, uh, star with the Blue Jays, Greg Olson, Roy Oswalt was a uh, Houston pitcher great, Jim Parquet, Brad Penny, Jay Powell, Mark Pryor with the Cubs. Um, Bob Watson, I think he was the, I uh, forgot what uh, Major League Baseball front office role he had. Brian Roberts, Dave Roberts, Frank Robinson. So we've got another Hall of Famer. In this set, again, I assume that he was a coach on that team. J.C. Romero, David Ross, Kirk Sarlus, and we have one handful uh, to go out of this set. Aaron Seeley, uh, decent pitcher for a couple years. Ben Sheets. Grady Sizemore had a pretty good career with the Indians there for a bit. John Smoltz. So we've got a uh, the uh, Braves fans. I'm going to be a fan of that uh, card. Scott Spezio. 
at Sprague. Dave Stewart um, was he must have been a coach because a long time A's. Yeah, he was a Team USA pitching coach for a while. Uh, B.J. Serhoff, Bill Swift, Jason Tyner, Michael Tucker, B.J. Upton, Ron Valone. And uh, then it looks like uh, we must be having a subset here of Greatest Moments. So... Uh, this one is of Jim Abbott, so unless it's of a specific player, uh, these might not be as collectible. This is one about Doug McCavich, but it has a Lasorda on the uh, picture. It's one of Nomar Garcia Parra. Makes his way onto the USA team in 1992. 03 team. 2003 team, 95 junior team, youth team, Here's another with uh, Mark McGuire, and another one that is in a penny sleeve, so McGuire is honored by USA Baseball on 5-8-99, as the organization retires his 1984 uniform number, 41, and so he was a cardinal at the time, so it looks like that was actually uh, a photo from Bush Stadium. Marcus Jensen. And our last card here is Joe Maurer. So if everything was in the set, that was uh, 200 cards in that set. So I'd say that was worth $5. Uh, thanks for watching this video. If you uh, like this video, um, make sure that you uh, like and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Bye.